Hey guys, and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today I am going to be talking about something that I've wanted to talk about for a couple days, but I haven't sat down to make a video yet until now because I wanted to get all the information and not just say, oh, allegedly, this is a developed story. It's headlines. I know that you guys know what I'm about to talk about. If you pay attention to the news whatsoever, you know that Lori Laughlin, who plays Aunt Becky on Full House and Fuller House that's now on Netflix, oh, we, we, we don't stand a college scam. I am so upset because I loved Olivia and my second my second video on this channel is literally a review on Olivia's palette, and I was watching it back earlier, and I was like, oh, it's so good, I'm so proud of Olivia, she has it together, this girl knows what she's doing, I literally have the palette right here in my hand. Honestly, I don't feel like I was blindsided by this news, I felt like something was a little fishy because Olivia kind of talked about how she never really wanted to go to school for an education just the experience it rubbed me the wrong way as a subscriber if i'm being completely honest but everybody kind of says just little things like that and then she also made an apology video about it so i kind of just said okay well at least she admitted to her mistake Lori laughlin sweetie you made me upset i would absolutely look forward to olivia posting her like 2017 slang or her 2018 slang with her mom because I actually found Olivia because her pretending to be a super fan on Full House she did or Fuller House she did a video on that and I was obsessed with like oh my gosh this girl is so good like at doing like everyday makeup this girl has bomb outfits this girl has sponsorships and she has people or in companies that absolutely are so good and that I love she's 19 she's my age and she has completely blown it I'm gonna talk about I want to talk about it because I'm a college student and second of all I made that video hyping up Olivia's palette and I just want people to know that I no longer support Olivia Jade I no longer support Lori Laughlin because this scam so what like if you're if you're rich, like, good for you, you've earned it, but don't disadvantage other people who... Okay, this is the thing that gets me. I have never in my life been athletic. This is coming from someone who has not one athletic bone in her body, but from someone who sees her cousins work incredibly hard at soccer and in track. And my cousin, Nick, he's the same age as me, he... He does this stuff all the time, and that's his extracurricular activity. My younger cousin Sam, he does soccer, and it's just, I see my aunt toting my my cousins back and forth and working so hard to make sure that, you know, she's getting them to their games and all that, and I see them all working so hard. And for, for Olivia to get a a spot on the rowing team when I know that girl has never picked or she may have picked up a row but does she have experience no that should go to someone who has completely earned it to take away that opportunity from someone disgusts me completely because there's people out there like my cousins who work extremely hard at their sport at their craft and then you have people just swooping in there taking opportunities like that I was watching earlier this girl who went to school with Olivia and her sister Bella when she was in high school and she was talking about like how she never showed up to class and like how she would only have to like focus on school if she wanted to even get into USC because it was that hard and it like LA schools are apparently a lot of pressure and a whole lot of workload and just to see that I, I don't know it just really the whole thing bugs me out I I feel not bad for Olivia because she knew she had it coming if she got caught but at the same time like I have to kind of feel bad because this girl had absolutely like everything as a subscriber and a college student I'm disgusted as someone who sees my cousins again work extremely hard it just upsets me 
And someone who watched Full House upsets me. I grew up on that. I would look so forward to watching Fuller House. And I just feel like now it's all like time wasted. Funny enough, one of her shades is called Legal. And um, how ironic that this is very illegal. Maybe she'll come out with another one like called Fraud. I don't know. Scam. I just also wanted to say that since this came out that Lori Laughlin has been dropped from Hallmark and Full, Fuller House said that they could easily pull her from their fifth season too. Like I can see it happening because they don't want that publicity for them because this is so much farther than just like a, a like a little headline. Like this is breaking national news and it's been like developing and new scandals and it's just a whole mess and like her dad also was a part of this and he he has a clothing line at Target and Target is one of my favorite places ever. Like I love going on Target runs with like my friends like Bobby and that's like our hobby. We love just walking around Target randomly. It just, I, I'm at a loss for words. Like I'm sitting here trying to think what can I possibly say? They're getting sued for $500 billion. Like, this family had it all lined up. He was a fashion designer. She was an actress. She had YouTube. She was so successful. She had me as a subscriber. And she's losing so many endorsements and everything. And it's just, like, crazy how something can switch so fast. So someone I spend my time watching and giving views, all of a sudden absolutely has headlines all over the place and it's just crazy to me and I can't even wrap my head around it like I'm just sitting here like I had points about like my cousins and doing the sports but I'm now I'm sitting here absolutely at a loss for words I never wanted to take my parents money and like do away with it and go to a university that I have like no idea what I want to do with my life and now I know that I want to do media communications like I would love to be like a talent manager or publicist and those things are things you have to earn just like getting into college I don't I don't get it I get that they're rich and I get that they can buy expensive things and not have to think about it twice but at the same time it doesn't come that easy to everyone. You have to earn getting... And the thing that bugs me out, she didn't even want an education. She wanted to party, and I know she retracted that, but she still said it. I... I don't know what to say. I can say I have unsubscribed. I... I'm going to watch her apology video if and when she comes out with one because I want to see what she says. But further on from that, I will not be giving her my views. I will not be giving her any of my hard-earned money. It's just, I know so many people who work so hard and so many people got probably overlooked because of Olivia just getting and buying her way into college. And this is, I, I don't know. I feel like it should be something that's completely earned. And I just really wanted to make this video stating my views and stating that I no longer support Olivia Jade. I no longer support Lori Laughlin. Honestly, I really hope that Fuller House does decide to pull her out of her episodes for season five. They have not started filming yet, by the way, um, because I can't watch Fuller House season five knowing that this happened and I would just have such a sour taste in my mouth. Anyways, I just wanted to say from a subscriber, a viewer, and a college student's perspective who sees people work insanely hard every day that I am very disappointed. And like I said, I'm sorry that this video was very rambly. I didn't half know what to say because there's so much information on it. I love you guys so much. Thank you for listening to me absolutely ramble. I I appreciate it, but I really just wanted to share my viewpoint on this. But anyways, I love you guys. Thank you for watching. If you guys have video requests below, if you kind of like this 
the side like where I talk about like breaking news I could start doing videos like that just let me know what you guys want to see in the comments below I love you guys so much sorry the harsh lighting is happening I just kind of sat down and filmed this it's kind of just bad and, and no I don't have a ring light I'm not Olivia Jade I'm not I'm just I'm just here making mediocre videos but having good points maybe but thank you guys so much for watching if you clicked on it I really appreciate you hearing me out and please let me know what you think about this below if you were subscribed to Olivia if you watch Full House if you're a college student wh whoever you are I want to hear your viewpoint and I love you guys so much thank you and I will see you in the next one bye